guys my name is Becca uh, I wanted to start this YouTube channel because I've been Halloween decor hunting for years now and I didn't know that it was a whole community on YouTube and I want to be a part of it so okay today's the 4th of July and I'm gonna go Halloween decor hunting I'm very sick right now <laughs> So I got out of the hospital last night. Um, I was at work and I just felt like I had this balloon in my stomach that just kept getting bigger and bigger and like the balloon was made of cement. I was in pain. Oh my God, there's like a dog hair in my mouth. I was in pain. Excuse me. Oh my God. And I couldn't do it anymore. I was in tears. I couldn't breathe. I couldn't walk. I couldn't do anything. So I went to my manager, I was like, hey, I gotta go to the hospital. So I went. I was there for hours and hours. I thought I just had really bad gas or maybe I was constipated, but turns out I have food poisoning from some Costco mac and cheese. Never ever making that mistake again. So right now I'm at Kroger and I have to go drop off a prescription and um, we're gonna, while we're waiting for that prescription, cause there's like four or five of them. There's four of them. Probably gonna take a while. Home Goods is right next door. I might as well step in. Now Home Goods, I know that some people have been getting their stuff trickled in. Some people have had no luck whatsoever. Um, I was there about three or four days ago and they had nothing, not one single thing but I grabbed a couple things that I liked and I went to the register and I asked the lady oh my god there's someone at my window sorry there was someone at my window um I asked the lady if uh she knew when she was getting her Halloween stuff in and she goes oh probably a, someone told me about a month I'm like that doesn't sound right to me so maybe she meant next month it is now next month it is now the 4th of July so maybe we'll have some luck maybe we'll see like a mug a blanket a pillow something just one little something something I'm based in Memphis um, I know there's a lot of these content creators that are all over the place they're in Kansas they're in Texas like but I'm in Memphis, so maybe I could help fill a gap across the YouTube map. That rhymed. I feel awful today. So probably I wanted to go to At Home because I know At Home has their stuff out. I've already been there like two or three times. My back seat is full of bags. But we'll see, maybe there's something new. Um, I wanted to go, but I don't know if I'm up for it right now. I'm feeling awful. Hey, this will make a good story for my very first video so yeah we're, let's run into Kroger real quick drop off this prescription and then we'll walk over to home goods oh my god oh my god I could cry right now I just want some relief dude I don't feel good at all oh my god I'm so upset right now I don't know why I didn't think about it it's fourth of July it's a fucking holiday you know what Starbucks is right there this is so very much TMI, but I don't care. Maybe I'll just go get something from Star. Look at this lady's outfit. Look at her outfit. Yes, queen. Oh my God, I love this. I just realized my lips were very, very chapped and that's embarrassing. I also just woke up. I'm dehydrated from the food poisoning, obviously. But yeah, maybe if I go to Starbucks, get something to clear me out a little bit. Because this hurts. This hurts bad. And then we'll go to Home Goods. Hi, I have an order for Rebecca. Rebecca, yeah, where Thank you. So I just remembered someone told me a long time ago that you should always film horizontally. And I just remembered. So we'll see how that intro goes.
officially witnessed my very first phone fall, I'll call it that. I have a mount for my phone on my dashboard, but it is cheap. It is not very well made. Um, but I've had it forever and it's, you know, it's never steered me wrong, but now it's getting old, so it's not very sticky anymore. I promise, this is my first video, okay? Cut me some fucking slack. But I promise it'll get better. Once I figure out how to do all of this, I don't even know how to edit this video. No idea, but I'm gonna figure it out. I figured, well, I can't learn to edit a video if I don't have a video to edit. So I'm just recording as I, as I go today and we'll see what happens. I'll look up some YouTube tutorials, see how I can edit this. I got a strawberries and cream frappe. It looks awful. I know it looks terrible. It looks like placenta. I don't know. What does placenta look like? I don't fucking know. Um, but it is a strawberries and cream frappuccino, add mocha and java chips. And it tastes exactly, exactly, exactly like chocolate covered strawberries. And it's delicious and I love it. So that's our order. All right. Let's go to Home Goods. Guys, we did it. It's our first Halloween sighting at Home Goods this year. Now they had this little Mickey ghost last year. I actually own it already. Um, but we just got in, so we have a whole store to go through. So let's see what we can find. We've officially found Mr. Skellington, but he's obviously not supposed to be on this shelf because it's a bunch of trash cans. But $13. Well, y'all, they had something. I mean, like I said, I was there a couple days ago and they did not have one thing. They had that one little Jack Skellington soap dispenser and then that Mickey ghost. Now that Mickey ghost, they had three of them. They were kind of sprinkled out around the kitchen section. Yeah, I'm gonna give it another week or so. And I'll come back. Do I really want to go to at home right now? I don't feel good. It's a 15 minute drive. I didn't come all the way out here for nothing. I couldn't even drop off my prescription. All right, let's go. Let's, let's, let's go. All right, we are here. Cute little branchy, but it kind of looks like a pineapple tree, if that makes sense. And little sign. This is cute little witch hat. Have you seen this before? And it looked a lot bigger online than it did it does in person. Like, this is literally my hand for comparison. It's not that big, and I kind of don't care for it. It's kind of cheesy and I also don't like the blue. These little toes are adorable. They're $8. Oh, they're like kind of heavy. Hmm. It's almost like, like a hard plastic. This queen, I know her eyes light up red. I've seen her before. So this year I've been collecting like different kinds of jack-o'-lanterns and I think I might swoop this one up real quick. Let's see. So I have, oh no I forgot at home doesn't usually have like the buttons that you can push to actually light it up. Except this guy, I've been wanting to get him. <laughs> Thank you. He's really big. Um, I saw him online, and now that I see how big he actually is in person, and he's kind of loud as well, he likes to have different colors. I'm gonna get him. I've been collecting different jack-o'-lanterns. I'm trying to make like like a stack of like different sizes, different colors, different faces, different themes. Like he's gonna fit perfectly. So he's coming. Oh, that's why he's forty dollars. He's flat in the back. He has no booty. 
like he looks like he hangs up on the wall. Hmm. Yeah, he's still coming home with me. Come on. These cute little white pumpkins. They got all kinds of like door hangers, like to hang your wreaths. I like these, but I don't really like the blue. Like, I don't, my Halloween in my house is black, orange, green, and purple. So, like, I think throwing some blue in there would kind of be off a little bit. These are kind of cute. I have this little cat. He's adorable, and I love him. Something similar to that. Just a bunch of hocus pocus. Got some little branchy tree picks. Let's see. Oh my god, I'm hitting everything with my car. So amazing. Oh, there's like yard signs. Okay. So. This was not here last time I was here, and I'm kind of in love with that. I love that the nails are purple and glittery. Ooh, this might be coming home with me. How much is she? She is, ooh, $35. Why is she so expensive? I kind of love her, though. We'll put her in the cart for now. We'll see. I've also been seeing this online everywhere, and she's a lot bigger than she looks online. She's bigger in person. How much? How much are we looking at? Hello? Do we have a price? $40. See, like, it's just so easy to whack up a bill. Oh, these are new. So, hoe down skeleton with a four. Skeleton taking a bath with some moonshine. Oh no, poison? What does that say? Yeah, poison. These I have not seen yet. More glitter nails. Cute. Only ten bucks. Little spider. Hmm. Oh man, we have a lot more to look at. <laughs> Oh, these I thought about getting. We'll see. Maybe later. Got a bunch of baskets of little tiny jack o lanterns blacks and purples. Alright, let's go. Okay, looks like over here we have all the cutesy stuff. This little metal. And that hurt really bad. Oh my god. Hello. This, is, this first video is going so well. Oh, so beware of the little monsters. into the Halloween hoedown type of stuff. That's just my personal preference. I think these guys are adorable, but they just don't fit with my theme, I guess. These little sacks of glittery pumpkins. These guys are so cute. I have him. I really want him. This guy's new. He's working on a laptop. $27. I have him. I was looking for him for a couple weeks now, but I finally have him. Love him. I don't understand this. Boo, y'all. What does that mean? Like, boo, y'all. What? Stop it. Cute little tiny ornaments. I have a big tree, though. Well, not like big, but not tiny either. Some more pumpkins down there. This guy's kind of cute. What's wrong with his lips? I don't understand. And he's going to use a pumpkin, which I personally don't think he should be $20, but he lights up. 
Every time I come in here, they have more and more stuff out, and that just makes me so happy that they're trying. What does this guy do? Oh, just have a little light in there. He's cute. This guy, what is he doing? He's pretty big. Forty dollars. Okay. Some more fly stuff down there. Some more little jack o' lanterns. They light up. So this stuff is cool. Lots of witchy, gargoyle, kind of gothic. This guy is big in person. It's $130 and he's ripped. Like my man drinks his protein shakes. Some more cutesy stuff. Some little money hands that go in your yard. Only 10 bucks and they're kind of big. Like this is my hand and I have long fingers. So he's pretty big for 10 bucks. Dragons. Holy shit. How did I not notice this the second that I walked in? What up, Bone Daddy? You are huge. This cute little bow. Hmm. Some little bats. This guy, he's 130. He's pretty big. He's like, he's taller than me. But like, I don't like the brown, like, rusty, dusty color I like you know like he's lighter I don't know why but I guess it, just because he doesn't go with my theme you're gonna hear me say that a lot by the way so buckle in because I'm probably going to annoy you more pasta. these guys are cute I think he goes in the dark if I'm not mistaken What's this guy do? Looks like his eyes light up. He used $30. These are cute. Oh, flamingos. I want to put those out now, considering it's literally the, the 4th of July. Just a little teaser to let the neighbors know Halloween is coming little bleeding candles. I saw these last time. I thought they were really cool looking. Especially this guy. Like that's cool. But I feel like once it bleeds for like 10 minutes, you're not even going to be able to tell what it is anymore. But they're only three fifties. So. We got some sparkly skeletons. This guy's kind of cute. I know a lot of people hate the glitter with their Halloween stuff. Oh yeah, I see I barely touched them. But like, like a lot of people like matte black and I do too, but I don't know, I, I kind of I kind of like the glitter. I don't really like care for that much, but like black glitter, I like. These are cool, they're only $40 and they're pretty big. Let's see. Oops. Hello? Okay. They're pretty cool. 40 bucks. There's these guys. Oh, he lights up too. What does he do? Okay. Oh yeah, he just got a little light in his innards. And this guy. Now him. He's $130. He doesn't look that big on camera, but in person he's huge. And I really want him, but I don't really have a place to store him. He's huge. And these guys are ginormous. They're seventy dollars. I would I like them, but I wish they were black. Maybe we'll find some black ones eventually. Of course, we got Jack and Sally. Of course, with little Oogie Boogie in the background. Okay, so. <laughs> At home, obviously, has tried to jump on the bandwagon with that ghost. Oh, something behind me just broke. Oh no. Oh no. I don't know what it was. But they tried to jump on the bandwagon with that ghost from Cracker Barrel that sold out so quickly last year. He's not as cool. He's alright, but he's not as cool. We've been really 
picking up on the like gothic decor this year. I keep coming back and looking at him, but I just can't justify $22. I don't know why, but I just can't. He's cool. He is awesome. I love him. And he's actually really big. But he's $40. Okay, it's supposed to light up. Let's see. Maybe not. I bought him. He's cool. I like him. I think. Did I get him? I don't know. Oh my god, it's so loud. Hang on. I love these guys, but I really like this spiky pumpkin. He is $20. This is cute. It's only five bucks, but like, what would you do with it? It's not like it's a magnet. It doesn't go in the ground or anything. Like, what do you do with it? I don't understand. I love her. The red. I just I can't get behind the red. I know. I'm being really picky. I'm sorry. I have so much stuff already. I don't need to spend money on stuff that just doesn't fit or doesn't like make me oh so excited. And there's some, some more gargoyles. There's a tall gargoyle. Home sweet haunted home. We got spookies. This stuff. And of course, we have more jack lanterns. We have orange and black. I believe I have, oh, no, no, I have the black one. And then I have these big boys down here. I have one of these, which I love. They had these last year and they sold out like crazy. So I had to make sure I got some more this year. So he was my very first Halloween purchase of the year. I named him Scraps from Corpse Bride. If you know, you know. Um, got some creepy cloths. And then this guy, he doesn't really do anything. Oh, his eyes messed up. Oh no, it's just like popped out. I don't know. Yeah, we got this guy and his innards. Um, got some spideys. Seven dollars for one little spider? Oh, you were out of your mind. Uh-uh. Some Jack Skellies. Some more Jack Skellies. He's five dollars. See, that's more reasonable. But he's also rubber. But... We got these bottles. I think I have I have this one and I have this one because they're orange and purple, I think. Yeah, purple and orange. But this Jack one is white with like a little bit of something in there. I don't know why. I just, it didn't tickle my fancy. Oh, they have little oogie boogies. I didn't have them last time. It says it lights up. It's got a little little light in there. I just hate fussing with batteries all year. Especially these weird size batteries. Like, let me just stick some double A's in there and we'll be fine. So I bought this this year. Well, I don't know why this is there, but only $13. Little Ouija board placemat. And my boyfriend's mom is going to be pissed. And I think it's hysterical. She thinks I'm bringing the devil into her house. And I think it's funny. Um some skeletons doing a little doing a little jig these little jack-o-lantern says welcome and a little ghosty that says boo last time I was here they had this really cute ghost one but I forgot what it's I think it just said happy Halloween and had like some cute ghosts on it okay we have some yard signs beware of little monsters some pumpkins a happy Halloween yard sign. Got some witch hats, which are kind of cute. I just don't like the blue. I don't understand. The blue is very in this year, I guess. Like last year, and I think the year before that, it was like pastel pinks and things like that, which were like kind of cute. I get it. I don't know. I guess I prefer the blue over the pink because it, it's very like night sky, stars and moons and such. So, I mean, it's... It's okay. We have these guys for 10 bucks. I don't know what happened to him. He looks like that little skeleton thing on SpongeBob in the wheelchair. This guy is $30. Um, I don't like the brown. I don't know, like I said, I like 
blacks, purples, and greens, and oranges. I don't really like browns, I don't like tans, I don't like... Whites are okay, depending, depending on if I just love the piece that much. Dead ranch, all right. Okay, cool. And then a little fall sign. Looks like at home finally put a couple of animatronics out. There's people working over there, so I don't want to disturb them. They're trying to get Halloween out, and the last thing I want to do is prevent them from doing so. Uh, that's what we got. Walmart looks like. Well, you guys, we saw Halloween, which I already knew we would at, at home because I've been here like five times already. I've been, I've been shopping over the last couple weeks not gonna lie um yeah every time i come here they have more and more stuff out they haven't disappointed yet i can see that they're trying and let's i appreciate them i appreciate them so much that is a big ass b i'm not gonna bother him but he's huge he's a big boy he's plump um so yeah, yeah i think we're done for today uh, thank you for joining this very first Halloween hunting video. Um, there will be more. There will be hauls. Um, plenty and plenty of hauls. There will be decorate with me videos. I have so much stuff now that it's actually kind of insane. Also, just so you know, I'm not just a Halloween gal. I'm also a Christmas one. I get just as excited for Christmas as I do for Halloween. And... I will be also going Christmas decor hunting. Christmas decor collecting. We'll, we'll find a name for it. Um, yeah, so don't be surprised if you see me get all excited over Christmas when it's not even Halloween yet. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't help myself. I just, it makes me happy. And so if it makes me happy, then cool. Um... So yeah, that's it for today. Thank you guys so much. Bye.